Hi, I'm Trish Lee and you are watching Thrive with Trish, the place to be to build your confidence and make your dreams happen. Do you hesitate from taking the first step towards achieving your goals? If yes, then today's show is a must watch for you. I'm going to be sharing with you my four top tips that has helped me push past that feeling of hesitation. Tip number one, define what perfection means. If you are waiting for that perfect moment to come, and then you're going to try going after your dreams. But do you know what does that perfect moment mean? Because if you don't have a clear idea in your mind, what does the perfect moment mean? Then even when it does come, you won't even realize it and it's just going to slip away. Furthermore, life happens. Perfect moments don't last forever. If you're only waiting for that perfect moment every time, only then will you have the courage to go after your dreams, then you will never be able to consistently pursue your goals. Why? Because as the Greek philosopher Heraclitus once said, change is the only constant. Tip number two, share your journey. Whether or not it's with your friends, family, or maybe even on social media, go ahead and share about your journey. You may just be surprised how many people you will inspire by you having that courage to take that step towards going after your goals. Plus, you may just meet a new friend that can become your accountable buddy and both of you can motivate each other towards achieving your goals smoothly. Tip number three, play out the worst case scenarios. Yes, you heard me right, the worst case scenarios. Sometimes the reason why we don't have the courage to go after our goals or to even take that first step is because we fear of the unknown, but you can't fear what you already know. So once you plot out all the possible setbacks that may come your way and plan for all the appropriate contingency plans, then there's nothing to fear. Tip number four, go with the cues of the universe. There's a very beautiful quote by Danielle Laporte and she says, going with the flow is responding to cues from the universe. When you go with the flow, your surfing life force. It's about wakeful trust and total collaboration with what's showing up for you. So my dear friends, even if you have a very successful plan and you have thought about all the worst case scenarios, but still life happens and something unexpected happens, something way beyond what you could ever thought was possible happened, please don't be discouraged. It is not the end of the road for you. Learn to go with the flow. Even if something unexpected happens and you are pushed off your path and you're heading down a detour, just go with it. You may just be surprised to discover a whole new path that you never knew existed and a whole new path that is so beautiful and magical. I truly hope these four tips has helped you to open up your heart to have courage to simply try. Now, let's end today with a quote of the day. Hesitating doesn't save you from failure. It deprives you of realizing your fullest potential. Now, I'd like to hear from you. In what scenarios has hesitating stopped you from going after your dreams? And what have you done to help you overcome that feeling of hesitation? Let me know either in the comments below or over at my website, trishenko.com. And while you're on my website, don't forget to sign up for my Trish exclusive newsletter to not only receive a free ebook on how to build unshakable confidence, but also to receive empowering tips, freebies, and so much more from myself that I don't share anywhere else. Also, if you have any questions, do feel free to write to me over at my page, Ask Trish Anything, and I'll be more than happy to come back to you with some empowering tips. My dear friends, did you like this episode? If yes, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and share this episode with your loved ones. Live strong and have the courage to create a life you love because your happiness matters. Thank you so, so, so much for your support. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you next time on Thrive with Trish.